This film shows how to install APC white face gauges. Before we take anything apart, we'll run the engine for 20 minutes. While the engine is still running, take a picture of the cluster to record the position of the needles. Now we're ready to disassemble the dashboard. Remove the screws that hold the bezel in place, unclip it, unplug all electrical connections, and set it aside. Next, remove the four screws that hold the cluster in place and take it out. Now remove the lens and you're ready to work on the cluster. Use the tool included in the kit of your APC white face gauges to remove the needles. Hold down the needle with a thumb of one hand and use the tool in the other hand to slide it under the needle and pop it out. As you remove the needles, arrange them in the same sequence as they sit on the cluster so that you can put them back in the same place. Now pull off the factory face gauge. Now that the cluster is completely naked, you can apply your APC white face gauges. The kit has protective paper on the sticky side. Remove the paper, align the white face gauges over the cluster, and stick it down. Now that the white face gauges are on the cluster, put the needles back temporarily. Push them in just enough to hold because the needles will need to be removed from the cluster during the process of calibrating the gauges. In order to begin the calibration process, we need to put the cluster back in place. Let the vehicle run for 20 minutes. Now we'll use the picture that we took at the beginning of the installation as a guide for calibrating the gauges one by one. We start with the oil pressure gauge. Check the picture and place the needle on the cluster in the same position. Repeat the same steps for the rest of the gauges on the cluster. If any of the needles do not reflect the reference picture, you'll need to recalibrate them. Now your installation is complete and all that's left is to put the dash back together. APC white face gauges are available with blue markings, red markings, and in a flame design. Here we show how the red gauges look at night. Here's a set of blue gauges from a previous installation. 